it's marathon day welcome to a beautiful sunny hove and we're walking to preston park our accommodation is just down the road and i've got about the foot well the first time trial of the day is to make it to the start line on time uh, i've got about a 3k walk and yeah when we get there i'm just gonna get there nice and early just relax and just just basically try and just soak it up as much as I can. I don't want to be rushing around today. I got up nice and early. Feeling pretty good, if I'm being honest. I'm feeling, I'm feeling all right. I've just got this nervous feeling. It's just, it's just so strange to be so nervous about something that is potentially so much fun. So, but yeah, the sun is shining. Feels like perfect running conditions today. So Laura's arranged to meet me or so cheer me on I guess at mile 14, 18 and hopefully as, as close to the finish line as she can get. At mile 18 I've affectionately named as my Wilson mile because I've never run any further than 18 miles in training and that was six weeks ago. So the film Castaway with Tom Hanks and Wilson where Wilson floats off into the distance that's how I'm going to feel for the remaining eight miles of the race. <laughs> I will just feel completely on my own, I guess. And I just, oof, I just don't know what's going to happen after that. I mean, I've got to make it to 18 miles first and foremost. When we get there, yeah. we're near the start line now. I can hear the announcer. Oh, it's getting real now. It's getting real. On the greatest days of the year in the city to see all of you and all your family, friends and supporters out on the streets for all sorts of great reasons. Here we go kids, we're nearly there. All that training. We made it to the start line. Remember the second wave, yellow wave, 10 o'clock, should be up towards your corral now. We are, we are off Brighton Marathon 2022! 20, yes, right, don't start too fast. <laughs> Okay guys, 10k in. Sitting fairly comfortable at about 5.40, 5.35 pace. This is just, just about perfect. The conditions, phenomenal. Gentle breeze. What is it, about 10 degrees today? I'm so glad I chose Brighton for my first marathon. So glad.
going through 20k now still maintaining that pace somehow <laughs> stubbornly i'm staying in front of the pacer but i know he's going to do me very soon feeling okay 20k down almost halfway there feeling good Spider-Man, Spider-Man. Yeah, Mr. GoPro. Do you know how good you look? Yeah. Man, this is quality. Look at all these people. <laughs> Finish line just behind me. What an atmosphere. Look at what I found. How you feeling, mate? I'm feeling okay. Good man. Feeling okay, we're over the hardest bit, which yeah. is the first half, because it's hilly. We're yeah. on the flat a bit now. Yeah. We've just got to hope we save some energy for it, really, yeah. haven't we? Yeah, mate, I think we're, uh, hopefully, yeah, but, mate, I've got marathon brain. I don't even know what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, I'll let you carry on, mate. Thank You're you. moving a bit wet, better than me. Yeah, keep going. Yeah, mate, have a good one. See you at the end. Yeah. You got this. I'm done. I'm done. You got I'm done. it. You can do it. Keep going. Keep going. You got this. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Well, here we are. Kilometer 30, mile 18. And it's... Talk about art imitating life. I've just watched the four hour pacer drift off into the distance. <laughs> just all about completing this thing now I'm uh, I wouldn't say I'm in bad shape but finding this really tough having fun though 12k to go kilometer 30 kicking my ass but I will not be defeated We can get this finished. Let's keep on keeping on. One foot in front of the other. Why do I have a feeling that this is going to be the longest 10k of my life? Well, we're deep into the difficult section, which is the industrial estate. And although it's nice and flat, it's tricky because I don't know if this helps. Well, it really helps me. There's just no, no crowds here. So it makes a big difference to me anyway. But we've just crossed the 21 mile marker. Five miles to go. If we can get this far, I think we can finish it. Cheers to you guys, you're doing awesome. Thank you guys for volunteering. 5k to go. I'm going to have to dig deeper than I've ever dug. I'm bonking harder than a young one, Jeremy here. I've been this exhausted in my life. Yeah. Yeah. Can't even lift the GoPro up. Yeah. 
is amazing. Come with emotion. Well done, well done. I can't believe it. Nearly there. around 26.2 miles. I can't believe it. Speechless. That was one of the best things I've ever done in my life. By far the hardest. Every single ounce of me was used in that run. Physically, emotionally. Oh my God. Oh God. I can't believe it did it. was absolutely bonkers. That was the hardest thing by a mile, by 26 miles I've ever done. The, the, the places that I had to go to in my head to dig that marathon out 
I've never been to before. That was just, I feel like it's like, did that really happen? Did I really run 26 miles? Did I really run from my house to Birmingham? Like, that's ridiculous. It, uh, <laughs> my overwhelming feeling is just happiness. It's just absolutely amazing. I just feel, just feel really proud of myself. Am I allowed to say that? That I did the Brighton Marathon. Four hours, 22 minutes or 23. Time's irrelevant. I'm not really that bothered. I just wanted to complete that marathon and I did. And it's a massive metaphor for life for having a goal, working hard towards it, and achieving it. <sighs> Rachel, you kept commenting saying you'll never ever forget your first marathon. And I, I, I just, as far as I'm concerned, I will never ever forget the way I spent four hours, 23 minutes running through the streets of Brighton. That was just incredible. What a feeling. And I just feel happy grateful and now very very relaxed as we wait for our guilt-ridden takeaway that's coming any minute now so thanks for watching you guys i hope you've enjoyed this one let me know what marathon should i do next as long as it's not in the next couple of days because i think i might take a week off so anyway thanks for watching you guys are awesome and i will see you on the next one Ta da I'm a marathoner! Woo!